Hello everyone and welcome to the virtual demo of the Community Points Engine. I'm Vicky and I'm leading PR for OMG Network and I'm so excited to be here with you guys today. This session will be quite brief. Um, it will only cover the demo itself and it will basically present to you what the CP or Community Points Engine extension looks like, how it works, how you can use it as well. Um, as you guys know, this is our submission for the great Reddit Scaling Bake Off, which is the open invitation competition that Reddit put out to the Ethereum community for scaling projects to see who can bring the community points to mainnet. And as most of you know, the OMG Network team loves a good challenge. So our team only had one goal in mind as they were building this, and it was to create a live and scalable application that our 40,000 strong community can use to transfer community points on the subreddit, which we're now calling rocks. So I know a lot of you guys have been throwing rocks throughout the weekend and we've been loving all the support and it's definitely been great. And if you haven't joined in or if you haven't tried it out, this is the right place to start because then you'll see how it actually works. So to kick it off, we're going to show you the video and then right after that, Pong's just going to jump in and show you guys how the CP extension works. Introducing the Community Points Engine powered by OMG, the easiest, fastest, and most secure way to send and receive community points on Reddit. Reddit user, send and receive community points right from your browser. Check your balance in near real time, all while browsing the subreddit. Moderator, immediately mint and distribute points to anybody on the subreddit. Burn points and handle all admin actions with a user-friendly dashboard. Reddit team member, powered by OMG Network, the Community Points Engine is fearless and can withstand the traffic threshold that Reddit requires using our more viable Plasma technology. This is the video demonstration of how Community Points Engine works on Reddit. First, you need to make sure you are on the correct community. In our case, it is the OMG Network subreddit. Then you simply click on the browser extension. On this application, you can see your current Reddit account with the associated point balance for the current subreddit. You can make a transaction, view transaction history, as well as purchase items from the store. Let's make a transaction. First, you input the amount of points that you want to send. Select the username of the recipient and then click on transfer. This will open a MetaMask pop-up that prompts you to sign the transaction. Once you click on sign, simply wait a few seconds and then the transaction will be included. The content of the transaction is also shown on a block explorer. And that's it. No need to worry about paying gas or deal with crypto addresses. A clean, simple, user experience. So here's another video demonstration of the Reddit Community Points Chrome extension and how this whole thing works. So here we are at the Omiseko subreddit. And what we're going to do is we are going to try to open the Chrome extension. Here we have our MetaMask and our extension button on the top right. So if we click on this, it will tell you that you have to go to the correct supported subreddit, which is the new OMG network sub. So we'll click on this. And here we are on the new sub now. If you click on the extension again, you'll see that you'll have your username and you'll have your rock balance, as well as an ability to make a transfer, put in the amount recipient, check your transaction history. You can load multiple transaction history that you've done in the past as well as the ability to buy some flare for your username.
So for now, let's take a look at how the user identity works. So we'll scroll to the zero X thread. And here on this thread is where each user can put in their wallet address. And it, it will pretty much just match your username with your uh, crypto wallet address. So if I input the amount of 1000, I scroll down and trying to find an account that I can send to. Say I want to send to OM Giddy. I can scroll down and find his name in the, in the list here, or I could just simply type his name out. Here, once I click transfer, I'll have my MetaMask pop up. I'll see the transaction that I am signing. And once I verify, I can click sign. And just like that, the transaction will be pending. You'll see that in the transfer button, I would not be able to make any subsequent transfer until that has been finalized. The same thing as the merchandise page. I will not be able to buy Flare until this transaction history, uh, this transaction that is pending has been confirmed. Now that the transaction has been confirmed, we're going to take a look at the actual transaction uh, content. So I can just come down and click on it. I'll see the content of the transaction itself. You'll see my uh, current rock balance and the amount I've transferred. You'll also see the address for the fee relayer. This is the uh, wallet that absorbed the transaction fee for our transaction. Now let's go take a look at the merge tab. You'll see that we'll be able to buy uh, flare. So I'll click on the salamander flare. Click on the buy button. It will show the MetaMask pop up again. Scroll down to the bottom and click on sign. And now the transaction is pending for that flare purchase. Now, once the transaction has been confirmed, you can take a look at its content. And you'll see here that we have transferred our rocks to a burn address. So this is a burn transaction and that we have uh, a fee relayer absorbing the fee uh, once again. And yeah, that's it. That's the uh, whole demonstration of the merchandise, uh, the transfer, and checking over your transaction history. I hope you enjoy. And it's that easy. Thank you so much, Pong. And yeah, that basically wraps it up. This is the end of our virtual demo, but do not fret. I know that a couple of you guys did throw in a question here and there during the presentation. Feel free to bring those to our subreddit where we're going to be moving right now for our live AMA. I'll catch you guys there.